make an appearance in video with sleek new look to support Miss Anne Harriman. Prince Harry's wife released a divisive statement at the weekend. Meghan found herself back in the spotlight at the weekend following the publication of an article in The Telegraph, and her subsequent statement. But she put any ongoing drama to one side on Sunday to focus instead on her close friend, Miss Anne Harriman. Miss Anne is a long-time friend of Meghan's. He's been called on by the Duke and Duchess to document some of their most personal moments, from the announcement of Meghan's second pregnancy, to the first official solo portrait of their daughter Lilibet captured during the late Queen's Platinum Jubilee celebrations. With that in mind, Meghan filmed a short introduction for Miss Anne ahead of a recent TED talk, in which she spoke about their special bond. Meghan appeared on screen showcasing a sleek new look with her long hair worn down in a poker straight style. She said, our next speaker has an unmatched eye for a good photograph. I've experienced his talent firsthand as he has captured many meaningful milestones for me and my family and I know there are many others who share this experience. His lens has photographed everything from events that have changed the world. Invisible moments we all desperately needed to see along with some of the planet's most recognizable faces. But this wasn't always his path and you might be surprised to hear not who, but what he credits for his success. I am so thrilled to welcome to the TED stage, my dear friend Miss Anne Harriman. It comes after Meghan issued a statement denying claims made in the Daily Telegraph article at the weekend. The article stated that one of the reasons that Meghan wasn't attending the royal coronation was that she was left unsatisfied. By King Charles' response when she raised issues of unconscious bias within the royal family. It was claimed that Meghan wrote to the then Prince of Wales following her and Prince Harry's interview with Oprah Winfrey in 2021. Responding to the article, the Duchess of Sussex's spokesperson told. The Duchess of Sussex is going about her life in the present. Not thinking about correspondence from two years ago related to conversations from four years ago. Any suggestion otherwise is false and frankly ridiculous. We encourage tabloid media and various royal correspondents to stop the exhausting circus that they alone are creating. The Duchess of Sussex called the photographer behind Princess Lilibet's first birthday photo my dear friend at a TED Talks event. Meghan is celebrating her friend Miss Anne Harriman's latest accolade. The Duchess of Sussex introduced the photographer, entrepreneur and social activist via video before his recent TED Talk. Her first appearance since Buckingham Palace confirmed she would not attend King Charles' coronation with her husband Prince Harry. Our next speaker has an unmatched eye for a good photograph. I've experienced his talent firsthand as he's captured many meaningful milestones for me and my family. And I know there are many others who share in this experience, Meghan began. His lens has photographed everything from events that have changed the world, invisible moments we all desperately needed to see. Along with some of the planet's most recognizable faces, she continued. But this was not always his path and you might be surprised to hear not who, but what, he credits for his success. I'm so thrilled to welcome to the stage, my dear friend, Miss Anne Harriman. Harriman, who took some of the most circulated photos of the Black Lives Matter movement, and serves as chair of the South Bank Centre in London, thanked Meghan for the words of support. The Duchess of Sussex was kind enough to introduce me onto the stage for my act at thank you for the support Meg, he wrote on Instagram Monday. The Duke and Duchess of Sussex have turned to Harriman to capture important milestones before, f. Roam their 2021 pregnancy announcement to Princess Lilibet's first birthday photos in June 2022. Harriman and his family were guests at Lily's Frogmore Cottage Party. And he later appeared in the Harry and Meghan Decuseries, which debuted on Netflix in December. Meghan's surprise video introduction follows the news that she will not attend the coronation of King Charles and Queen Camilla in London. Buckingham Palace announced that Prince Harry will support his father at the crowning ceremony. While Meghan remains in California with Prince Archie and Princess Lilibet. The 6th of May coronation day is also Archie's fourth birthday, ah. And a source tells in this week's cover story that they will celebrate with a small party at home. It's going to be a low-key party at home, the source says. They all have friends around them and Meghan's mom, Doria, Ragland. Meghan will definitely have support that weekend. Of course, 
Archie's little sister will also be part of the festivities. They are so sweet together. Archie loves Lily. He's such a sweet boy. When she's not around, he asks, where's Lily the sorceress? Though family tensions eventually lead Harry and Meghan to step back from their royal roles in 2020. And relations have remained strained since the release of his memoir Spare over the winter. Kami the Duke of Sussex is thought to attend the coronation out of duty and love for his father. At the end of the day, he's going to be there for his dad, a close friend recently told. Thank you for watching. If you like our video, would you please help us like, share and subscribe our channel. Wish you happy to see our videos, thank you very much.